Hey guys, Faisal here with Samsung Galaxy S3 Soft Modder, and uh, today I'm going to show you a modded version of uh, the WhatsApp application. Um, if you don't know what WhatsApp is, it's a messaging app, uh, a lot like Google Hangouts or Facebook Messenger, but uh, it's skyrocketing in popularity, and I'm sure you guys have heard of it. Um, so uh, the version that we're going to install, what it does is it adds a ton of mods, uh, theming options, uh, all that stuff um, into the WhatsApp app application. So um, first thing you need to do is make sure you have unknown resources checked off uh, that is in settings, security, and um, it's right here. It's unknown resources. So make sure that you have that uh, checked. Secondly, if you have WhatsApp installed now, uh, you want to, uh, first of all, go ahead and go open it up, go to settings, and uh, back up your conversation, because we will need to delete uh, the original application and, so we could install the modded one over it. So in uh, WhatsApp, in the settings, you're going to go to chat settings, and uh, you're going to see backup conversations. Uh, when you do that, it's going to back it up, and then when you install the modded version, it's going to automatically restore those messages. So go ahead, uh, I have the link on the article, download that file, um, probably just directly to your phone is the easiest way, install it like you would any other file, and you'll notice right away that instead of the green icon, you have a blue icon, um, and that is the modded version. So it's going to open up uh, like normal, it's going to uh, run you through the setup where you um, verify your phone number, it's going to restore your, your conversations, and then it's really it's going to dump you into the, the main screen that you all should be very familiar with. Uh, the settings we're concerned with are the extra settings, and that's going to be right here on this little circle with the four colors. And um, so go ahead and just tap that. It's right. It's in between the search and the the new message button. Tap that, and you'll you'll see uh, WhatsApp Plus version three point eight five. If for any reason, uh, you know you you have this app already, or um, or maybe you know you're looking at this article a little bit later after the posting. What you want to do first thing is scroll down and uh, go to check for update. That'll let you know um, that you know you have the latest version. I just updated this, so this is the latest version, which is 3.85. So uh, a quick glance, you'll see there's a ton of stuff here. Uh, we're going to start with themes. So you have the option to download themes, um, uh, and these are uh, themes that other users have created. Um, so you know, browse through. There's there's literally a ton of them. Um, so you know, if that's your flavor, if you just kind of want an all-in-one shot, uh, go for it. Um, otherwise, you can also do individual theming. Uh, just check out some of these options in the conversation screen. You can change, you know, almost everything: the header, the chat, uh, the way that the pictures show. Uh, you know, a header, background color, contact photo size, things like that. Uh, kind of the same deal with uh, the main and chat screen. It's just more theming there. Uh, if you keep going down, you'll notice a pop-up notification. So um, you know you can control how that looks and how that operates. Um, you keep going down. Media sharing. This is cool. Um, the standard limit uh, is usually uh, I think 16 megabytes for uh, WhatsApp. You can increase that let's see, all the way up to 50, um, and it's just telling me when you do make that change, it's going to need a, to, a reboot. Uh, again, you don't need root for this, but um, um, but some of the settings that you change will require at least a soft reboot, uh, so I'm not going to do that now. Uh, you can also increase the image quality. Uh, the standard WhatsApp application really kills the image quality because uh, it just makes it easier to share pictures uh, that much faster. But you can turn that up if you'd like. Uh, I got mine pretty high up there. And then uh, we have other mods here. Uh, you know, auto updates. Uh, you can change the the color of the icon that you have. Um, you know, green, blue, red, pink, whatever, gray. Um, you know, you can change the color of this notification bar. Uh, corner photos, stock animations. Uh, there's even a dark theme for the settings. Uh, so there's really a ton of stuff here, guys. Uh, it, it'd be cool, you know, you guys just explore a little bit. Um, 
you know, try out some themes and maybe theme it yourself and uh, post some screenshots in the comments section. Uh, you know, we'd love to check it out. Also, if you find some cool settings that maybe I didn't cover here, uh, definitely let us know. So uh, that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, make sure you like the video and you subscribe to our channel and, uh, you know, check out the article for a full walkthrough. And uh, that's it. I'll see you next time. Thanks, guys.